gates are back and they're racing away. Rapidash was a bit awkward off the mark. Lucha Verde from a deep draw takes his medicine and will race towards the back of the field. William the first broke out well. Bright blue sky goes to challenge for the early lead after 200 meters, nothing in it. Then comes Gallic Dream who travels at the rail in third with Boogie Fired and Numzan at that group's outside. Length and a half away to Spring Palace. Then comes Rapidash who locks in sixth place. Further back, Vion's Grey, Lucha Verde just recovered to race just behind midfield. Fibonacci was next. Two lengths away, Green with Envy with Pineapple Express for company throwing his head in the air. After them to Max the Otter and Holy Orders. They the last two, they went past the 800. And in front, we have bright blue, or rather up front is uh, William the First. William the First by three of a bright blue sky who races the outside of Gallic Dream. Then we go a length and a half away to Boogie Fire, who could be well placed. Next best is Numzan. Spring Palace is in the uh, blue and gold colours. Over towards our inside is Rapidash. Lucha Verde makes a run towards the inside rail. They follow by Vion's Grey. Then comes Pineapple Express. Green with Envy. Yellow and black colours towards the outside. Got five to make up. With 250 left to run. Gallic Dream, Nums on. William the first. Boogie fight, all moving forward together. No room at the end for Bright Blue Sky. Rapidash, Green with Envy makes a ton of ground towards the outside. It's Gallic Dream in front, but Green with Envy has grown wings. Green with Envy wins it going away. That's impressive. Second goes to Gallic Dream. Then came Nums on and Lucha Verde. Bright blue sky, they were further back, so the winners towards the left-hand side, the yellow and black, still got his work cut out, got some horses to get to, plus he's giving a lot of them weight. One, two cracks, three cracks, and now it's all in from Green with Envy, and he's motored home. And like I said, if you weren't impressed with that, then not much will impress you. He's two from two, it's a huge step up for number eight, Green with Envy. He's still got to make a few more steps forward, but he's certainly on the right track. Race 6 Golf Racing Club Class 4 has been won by number 8, Green with Envy, the son of Give Me the Green Light, uh, coming off a bit of a rest and impressed again. Well then to Tabo Makrelane, he looks after Green with Envy and receives his 1,000 rand. Thank you to Hollywood Bets and Cape Racing. Craig Zaki was aboard and a uh, very good win from the horse. Craig, we were impressed sitting on our chairs watching the race. Were you impressed sitting on top of this horse? <laughs> yeah, Vex. Um, geez, it just gives a, a lovely feel. He's... He's quite laid back and um, I must say they went quite a hard pace and I mean I couldn't really keep up with them and at the same time I didn't want to force him to hold us but he couldn't, he couldn't on his own and uh, <laughs> when they turned into the straight that wind's really really picked up out here today and I think that just helped him go through the gears. Looking at him in the, in the winner's box I saw you took a moment and just sort of gave him a pat on that. He looks like a big baby, is he, is he still quite immature? Yeah, uh, like I say, he's very laid back. He's got one of the nicest demeanors. Um, very easygoing horse. And uh, that was just probably a seal of approval, I guess. Well, well done for the win. Thank you. Well done to Mr. Kenema, the guys back at home. Um, all credit really goes to them. To Lady Laidlord, um, thank you so much for this opportunity. To Jahan and their team, um, they've really given me a good opportunity. and. I'm going to make the most of it. So just a big thanks to them. And yeah, I think there's fun to come with this boy and to my sponsors. Maritz Fontaine and Wachtelbosschiff. Thank you. Well done. Thanks. It's uh, Craig Zaki. Next up, Dean Kenema. I spoke to him going into the race. And Dean, I think um, you were talking about this fantastic turn of foot. And, and as Craig said, it could also be the, the strong headwind that uh, maybe made it a bit easier for him. But it was quite impressive. Yeah, you know, he couldn't do more than that. You know, I, you could see he was, he was still lost first time at Durbanville. And it's only his second run. First one in Gravel, never been here. And, um, you know, when uh, he won, uh, it's one of the tours that come out at one, and I thought 193 has got him quite high. And um, I've never, I've never, I don't think I've ever won a fight with a handicapper, but he, he was right. But I never spoke to him about it. I thought it was a bit high in 93. But uh, today he won a good race because he made a, a hell of a lot of ground. He was lost, he didn't know. He pulled him out on top of the straight and the strong headwind. And, he was still green, he ducked in when, you know, when he was about to get there, he ducked in and pulled him off, so that was a nice win. So I'm very, very pleased for everybody. Um, give me the green light out of a Galileo me. Um, well done to Lady Laid, Lord Kaya Stables, and, and they bred him. And um, 
He's a nice type of horse. He's a nice scopey horse, you know. And if you look at him physically, he looks like a mala. He's not, gonna, he's not, not a speed horse. But uh, he couldn't do more than that. And I'm also pleased that it was the second win we've had today also because at the moment, uh, I don't really know where I am with these horses I brought back after the vaccinations, you know, gallops and things like that. And maybe they're better than what I think. But uh, <laughs> nevertheless, and Jean Malab and, 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 and the form bloodstock, you know, part of the team and that, you know, that was thrilled. But he's, that I, I, yeah, I thought he won a nice race today. And um, we'll see what happens on Monday after 2 o'clock. <laughs> Dean, well done. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, that's uh, Dean Kenamite taking us through comments on number eight, Green with Envy, the son of Gimme the Green Light. Well done to Kai Stables for both uh, breeding and owning and uh, also to Lady Laidlaw. Lovely type of horse and uh, look forward to what's to come in the season. I think that's what today is. Things are going to be unfolding as the meetings go on and uh, the season is most certainly building wonderful momentum.